Last year, in my video titled Big Changes in 2023, I made a New Year's resolution, which was to upload on the very first of every month of 2023. That is on January 1st, February 1st, March 1st, and so on. And I'm proud to say that I've actually completed that. You'll notice though, for the past couple of months, for the past three or four months, that the style of videos has been kind of like this, where I'm reading off of a set of bullet points, talking towards the camera, um, and giving my unfiltered thoughts, as opposed to my usual, usual style of video, which is, um, I guess, narrating a script. So the reason that I've kind of stopped, well, first off, you'll know that my videos are scripted when um, after every sentence, there's a cut. And the reason that I've stopped for now um, doing these scripted sort of videos is that is because it takes way too much time. Imagine writing an essay every single month. This is like the rough draft and final draft in every every single month. And it's actually more of like three weeks because I do take off a couple of days to do the editing of the video. And um, given that YouTube is sort of a hobby and language learning is my primary focus, it doesn't make sense to put in so much time into editing these videos. I shouldn't say editing, into, I guess, scripting, editing the script of the video um, when YouTube is just a hobby. Until I figure out a better way of writing these videos or maybe until I just become a better writer or a better, um, a better person in terms of uh, creating the outline, I'm going to be... Uh, my normal style of videos is just going to be like this, where I'm talking towards the camera and reading off of a set of bullet points. So hopefully you can understand with, unfortunately, that loss, that uh, drop in quality. So um, the title of this video should be something along the lines of, like, something big is coming in 2024. And it's true. In, let's see, November, I believe, of 2021, I came up with this idea. And this idea is bigger than, um, bigger than the... Bigger than the Chrome extension, bigger than the sentence mining scripts. Wait, did I say 2021? Sorry, I meant um, in the November of 2022. This I, you're right. In November of 2022, I came up with this idea, which is bigger than the Chrome extension, bigger than the sentence mining scripts, and um, it's going to be an entire website. I'm planning to have like a Patreon um, because it's going to be that big. So I've been working on it since I say February of 2023. And I haven't gone more than a week not thinking about it. It's going to be a website, of course, focused on language learning, that solves a very specific problem that I have, that I well, I had, because I, of course, I have, um, I can't say the exact um, problem, but I have this problem with language learning. And I was trying to go to find a website to help solve this problem, but I couldn't find any website to solve it. So I just decided to create it myself. I'm, I found a problem in the market, and I'm sure that other people have this problem too, which is why I'm creating the solution myself. I've been working on it for, as I've said, um, the past 10 months. Um, I'm lucky enough that when I, I actually mentioned this website in my Big Changes in 2023 video, a software developer offered to help me out and do a lot of the work for, for free. And how it's working now is that it's me and him, um, he and I who's working on the project, I'm focusing more on the design, saying like um, the navigation bar is going to be like this, a button will be here, when you click the button it'll do this, the, just the general design and style of the website. And um, I'm focusing on the HTML and CSS while he does more of the backend uh, database servers and, and TypeScript. So this is um, a massive project, of course, and um, I can't say exactly when it'll get released because it'll it'll get released when it gets released. I want it to be perfect. But if I had to estimate, probably the earliest is like mid 2024. But if we're being realistic, maybe even like late 2024. If it's not 2024, then 2025 is guaranteed. Um, this is very like abstract. And I, of course I can't tell you the, the actual idea or else someone might uh, take it. But I just want you to know that something big is cooking up behind the scenes. So yes, the last thing I want to talk about is my Anki streak. So about a week ago, I uploaded a video, which is now taken down, titled, I believe, Agony, where I lost my Anki streak of over 1,400 days. But it wasn't really legitimate because it was due to a time zone error. Basically, I was um, doing Anki cards in different time zones. When I went to another time zone, Anki essentially set the cards that I did for one day for the previous day, leaving the cards that I actually did for that day to zero. But someone in the comments offered or someone in the comments um, advised me to set my the time in which 
um, my Anki day starts, which is 4 a.m., to set it back from 4 a.m. to 2 a.m. And that solved my streak. So you'll see now that uh, my Anki streak is all good, 1,463 days. Everything's going great. Thank you to that person in the in the comment section who basically fixed my streak an hour after I uploaded that video. And the reason why I took that video down is because um, it just doesn't feel right when I fixed my streak and then having that video up saying I kind of lost it, it just didn't feel right. So I, I unlisted the video. The, the link will be in the description so you can watch it if you want. But um, yeah, that video is available if you want to um, look at it. So yeah, that's everything I want to talk about in this video. Um, well, yeah, I guess that's it. I'll, I'll see you in the next video.